Good evening. For January 7th, 2017. And let's take a look at the plants. Hopefully we can see the plants. Yeah. This plant, oh, it's sure doing good. We're going to chop it in half. Anyway, but not tonight. We're going to let it become a month old before we chop it. Oh, and that's on the 12th. Ta -da. Oh. Real nice. Really nice. Gonna raise the lights. This one here, about two clicks. And this one here, about two clicks. One click. Yeah, that's when I, I gave five clicks last time by accident. Yeah, very nice. And It's growing all over, all the way even down to the bottom. It just, just loves our light. Now the silver haze is a more delicate plant. It has good growth. looking plant. doing good and we'll see you next time these things are doing quite well I mean quite well let me let me get a close-up going here uh, before a close-up we don't want close-up before we do a close-up let's close-up thing probably can so or not ah. and the day hit uh, was down in, in the snow a couple times today went down getting old. Used to be I could go down and it wouldn't matter, but now it makes the time. <clears throat> Green tea. I recommend it. With honey. <laughs> 
I fell into the water with my green tea yesterday. Ah, uh, ruined my tea bag. And, yeah, that's in good shape. Took my tea bag out. And uh, it was hanging out the side, and it just sort of ripped up. And this washed downstream a little ways, not too far, but you guess what? It sinks. This sucker sinks to the bottom. You would think that it would float because, you know, there it is. Anyway, it sinks straight down. Anyway, that's, that's good. I just wanted to smoke something with you here. Say, uh, happiness is... Uh, a bong full of homegrown. Yeah, you think? And a uh, warm fire. And uh, and warm friends. Zip down here, set up to do a, a oh, why am I tilted like that? Sure makes you wonder. And am I even tilted? Possibly not. Yeah, that's what it is. Let's zero in on the, um, lemon tie here. It's doing very good. See how it's filling out? Oh, I love this tie. And now here's something that the kitty hasn't eaten and hopefully she won't. Isn't that a nice top? You know, and she's been eating everything on this plant. She just loves this plant. This is a good cat plant for whatever reason. Yep, sure is. That's what that is. That's the lemon tie doing exceptionally well. It's filling out, filling out this way. You know, it's a bush. No. Yeah, that's the freak plant. That used to be the second to the smallest plant. And now, and now, and now, less than a month after planting, we have a huge difference, huge difference in this plant. We're talking a large difference. And I wonder if we can see that plant there. Yeah, probably. So, that's what we got. A huge difference. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. And I'm really starting to think that waiting was the best thing. Because it's still going to be chopped in half, but look at this. This should make a good little start. This could make a good little start. This could make a good little start. And if I wait a few more days, which I'm going to, this will make a good start. So I've got my one, two, three, four, four starts, and where am I cutting it? Oh, five, six starts, so oh, cool. Wait, where am I cutting it? No. So this is one, two, three, four, five. Yes, four or five starts. Wouldn't that be sweet? And uh, but I am going to get all the parts to put the lights together. Uh, 
components and also be able to put together, modify, get everything done. For the new lights, way prior to these things uh, being ready to plant. So I'm going to, I have to get in touch with uh, my clone man where I bought this one. Yeah. And see if he's got some more of this. Yeah. And you know, it wouldn't make that much difference. I would just like to, I'm going to have some of these. If I can clone them, I'm not sure. I've never cloned anything, but hmm, really makes you wonder if that's a four or an eleven. I think it's an eleven. What's this one say? Yeah, who knows? Yeah, it's 11, it's all 11. Oh, there's that. Okay, now let's take a look at the silver haze here now. Well, we have to go way down. Way, 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 there it is. Oh, that's pretty nice looking plants. And we can... Zero in there and take a look. Here's here's what we got. And these things you can look back in the videos and see on the twelfth of December how big these were. About like this. And so they've done they haven't been filling out as uh as much, but they are filling out. Uh showing good growth. Good growth. Not spectacular growth, but good growth. Uh, they've tripled in size. That's nice. My estimate, I don't know. Uh, they were down here, and I, this looks like that would be triple. And uh, got lighter color, and there's a lot of, yeah. Could be real good pot. Look at that leaf, that's nice as well. Defined, this is coming in with seven points. Nice leaves. This and these have five points down here. So the leading edge has seven points. Nice. So this is starting to mature nicely. Nicely indeed. Might be extremely good pot to smoke. And I also think I could put four. Boy, my grass is in the shade down there, but it's still growing. Let me see if we can get to the grass. Now, there's the grass right down here. Yep, and it's growing, and it's totally in the shade. Pretty much in the shade. There's big leaf here, leaf there, leaves up that direction. Not that we're wanting to grow yard grass, but isn't it fun? Ah, yes. Oh, these are very, very nice. Can I get a better picture? Nah, maybe not. Ah. Oh, oh man, that's what the camera was doing. Well, I may have broke the camera. That's always possible. You know, you, you don't know. You, how many falls can a camera take? Yesterday it was in the water, but you know, that's where I didn't get the camera wet. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was very much wet. It was wet. I mean, it was wet. There was snow. There's been water. It's been raining often. But I think it's the falls. Or it could be a combination of everything. sort of fun would be to sort of take this and aim it. <laughs> Whoa. This is exciting. Yeah, this may not fit. Now this is cool. Now. Am I still recording? Oh yes. Now let me pull back. Now we got it. My, this thing is showing enormous growth under these lights. I would say twice the growth, two to three times the growth in volume. Yeah. In volume produced. So it's very aggressive plant under these lights and you know it makes sense that some plants would like this particular brand of of photo spectrum. And so when you're deciding on the photo spectrum, you have to, these are included uh, with grow white and many don't. It's the white that grows. There is a portion of white that will. And ultraviolet to green. And green doesn't do anything, but there's, there's a run up to it. And infrared. So there's that. And then the combination of how much of which. So this is a this is a choice.
Anyway, this plant likes it a lot. Now, it's got some purple. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. Reddish. Now, they were purple one time. Uh, lines up and down. It's really nice. Looks good. Quite a nice looking robust plant. Now does it have good pot? Don't know. I mean if you the only way that you could ever know would be to smoke it, you know. We'll be getting to that soon enough. Alright, so this was sort of fun. Or totally into a panoramic view. There's going to be a plan in there soon. I was thinking of putting it right where my half round is right now. I got this mylard, the wall, and this wall would get mylard and this door would get mylard. So, it'd be sort of like this side here. Everything is, everything is ready to go. And it's cool. Well, good night. Sleep tight. And and the sooner that you can, uh, I grew this pot here. That's mine. Good pot. Um, the sooner that you get your plants in the ground, let's do this. That's what the buckets say. Let's do this. Well, look what's happening. These lights are fantastic. Anyway, I hope you're all doing good and Now this was outside plot, and um, I've been working on these lights, and uh, f first the theory, and then the testing of the uh, of the theory and the bulbs, and and the fabrication and figuring out how, how exactly it's going to all put together. And bam, the package. And this is the package right here. This, this one. Uh, you got 65, 60 to 65 watts of uh, each one of those lights. Together, they're about 125. These are all, you know, uh, each bulb can uh, fluctuates a little bit as to what the LEDs are actually uh, drawing. But total, 125 watts between both of them. That's, that's like having a 100 watt light bulb growing four plants. That's, that's amazing. That's absolutely amazing. 125 watt light bulb. <laughs> Very little heat, and this is nice because the way that it's set up there, it'll go into that bucket. Uh, the dirt has to be out of the bucket, and the bucket should be clean, but it'll go right into the bottom of that bucket, 
everything and then put the lid on the bucket, has the handle, everything goes in there, your timer, uh, everything. Off you go. And it's a portable system. And one of them will grow two plants. Or that's the theory. We're, the, we're testing it now. <laughs> this is the test. This is the test. But the idea is for a portable system, and this is a, a portable for an apartment dweller. This is like, this is a closet. And this is a lot narrower. It's only 17 inches deep. That's it. And uh, that's not very deep. So you don't need to have much of a closet. This could be a... a a cabinet, you know, a, a floor to ceiling cabinet. And this is basically what this was. This had shelves in it. I took the shelves out and um, had the doors. And so this was, anyway, you clean it out. Uh, mine had never been painted ever. And so I gave it a good old uh, paint job and that really helped uh, for the reflective. Uh, between no paint, if it was just wood, bare wood, like the door there, or that door, that door would be better, brighter. But this is what the wood was right here on the inside. And see, it's a huge difference. If you look at the white back there, that's, that's what I'm talking about now. That white. See. And see the door there. I run out of paint there. Otherwise, that door would have certainly gotten uh, painted totally. But 